sorry, are we on? Yeah. Okay, here we are setting our cornbread to cook. We have a nice pan of cornbread here. It's got a matching pan for a lid. We've got a thermometer. I'm not sure if the, no, I don't think the smaller bag will work. So we will use, this is the size that they sell as turkey size. And I am going to use a pot holder to put the rack inside this bag because that pot, that rack is going to be very, very hot. It's always best when you can, when you have room, when it can fit, put your rack in the bag. That way you make a better oven chamber. What this oven chamber is doing, it's holding heat in your food. So, put this into this oven. Rack. And get it to work. Sometimes things get a little wobbly. And then we're going to gather this shut. Twist it a little bit so it stays shut. Use a twist tie, you can use a French clothespin, whatever you got that'll hold that bag shut. Okay. Now I'm gonna go from behind. And let's see. Okay, move a little bit, Camille, so you're not shading it. Okay, this is maybe a little bit more this way. We do want a little more shadow on the right than on the left. No, we want the sun to sit across the top. Put it in the middle here. In the middle of the day, your reflectors lean back a little more. Later in the day, they go forward a little more. I'll grab a rock or a brick so I can hold this back a little more. So we hold it back a little more, it puts a little better light. how hot that gets. It's going to be pretty hot soon. Okay. Here, I'm going to adjust this a little. This is our oven that we're getting ready for our cake. We're going to go in and make up a new cake. It's called Shake a Cake. You make it in a jar. It's very easy. You don't need power tools to make it. Something people anywhere, you know, if you can scrounge a jar. I mean, even in Kenya, foodstuffs come in jars. People can wash out the jar, get a jar. So we're going to go make a Shake a Cake next. And that'll